The first step in replacing the alternator is to disconnect the battery. If you don't, and you happen to touch the lead going to the alternator against something, it can cause permanent damage to the electrical system and yourself. Be smart here and disconnect it. The alternator is mounted just to the side of the tensioner. You will first need to remove the V-belt, the tensioner, and the throttle body. Please follow the link provided at the end of this video for additional assistance with those tasks. There are two 13 millimeter bolts, red arrows, holding it to the bracket. Remove these bolts. There is a very good chance you're going to need a small pry bar to remove the alternator from its bracket, red arrow. They tend to get corroded to the bracket over time and need a little help to release. Use caution as you do not want to damage the alternator or the bracket while doing this. With the alternator free, you need to remove a few things from the back before you can remove it from the engine compartment. Begin by disconnecting the electrical connection indicated by the red arrow. Remove the protective cap and the 13 millimeter nut red arrow from the main electrical line. Finally, remove the 8 millimeter nut holding the bracket that supports the wiring harness to the alternator red arrow. You can now remove the alternator from the engine. Installation is the reverse of removal. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to our channel and check out another video in this series.